Oh, that Jackson song was so stinking good. Yeah. Jackson wrong. Ow, I just hit myself in the face. What the heck? Ow, that hurt. Okay, we're not gonna hit ourselves in the face again. Hey there, Kinnick, it's the K-Pop here. It's back again with you today with another brand new reaction video. My name is Rachel, and I like K-Pop, so we're gonna be reacting to it today. So today, we are going to be watching the music video of one of my absolute favorite groups, and that is Super Junior, D&E, and they came out with a song called B.A.D. I'm not going to call it bad, though, because they put some dots in the middle, so we're going to be calling it B.A.D., because I'm going to assume that means beautiful and dangerous. I don't know what it means yet. I haven't watched the video, but if I'm right, I will be really proud of myself. <laughs> so... I don't want to babble anymore though because I'm just really excited to watch Dong Hae because every single time I watch videos of him I always talk about how he touched my hand and it's a whole story and um, you just watch me fangirl the entire time. So we're going to hold that fangirling story for the end or I'll just make you go back to my last video wherever I talked about it. So let's just get right on with the video. All right, Kenneth, let's watch the video in three, two, one. Okay. All right. They're on horses. Okay. I'm confused. All right. Alright. I like this spicy color vibe that they're going for. I could wear a headband like that. I think I have one over there. Yes. Yes, Dong Hey. Yes. I like the guitar and like the distortion that they put on it. It's pretty cool. Just keep driving circles around them, car. Cause they're untouchable. You can't hit them. They're super junior DNA. Oh, I have a bucket hat like that in pink. Yeah. Hmm. Be cool. I'm not cool. They look way cooler than me. I like that earring that Dong Hae's wearing. It's pretty cool. It's like a deep bad. Yes. Ooh, that jacket he's wearing. Wait, go back to that jacket. I want that jacket. I'm pretty sure that jacket's actually from a really famous Korean street brand. Um, I looked at it and I was going to buy it, but I was like, oh, it's way too expensive. They had like a whole collection that looks like that. And I wanted the whole thing. Boo. Uh oh. All right. Ooh, yes, Dong Hae. Run, run, go through the window. All right. 
All right. Okay, I can dig it. Still a bit confused as to where the horses come from and why they added horses. I mean, because shortly after that, they switched from horses just into straight up horsepower. I'm a little confusion. So I am confusion. Why is this one Kansas, but this one is not Arkansas? America, explain! Explain! What do you mean in Arkansas? Um, this music video to me actually felt like it was a continuation of their series from the last music video or because of the fact that they don't actually have like the face tattoos yet and you know like getting, getting tattoos removed is a lot of work I'm actually wondering if this is like the prequel to their last set of music videos for Daniel. So based off of the concept that they had in this video I'm actually wondering if this is a prelude to Daniel because one they didn't have the tattoos in it but they were still um not villains but they were still criminals they were stealing things and getting stuck into gambling and all that other kind of stuff as they showed in that one scene and then there's still horses and horsepower i mean i i still don't know why they needed the horse whenever they just showed lots of horsepower after that with the cars but this definitely felt like a continuation of their last album just gonna say Uh, Korean word of the day is actually going to be the Korean verb to be bad, which is napuda. Napuda. One more time for y'all. Napuda. So napuda means to be bad. Um, in this scenario, they literally just spelled it out B A D bad bad, um, and then did like some really cool meh, 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 dance. But um, in Korean, you would actually say napuda. So if you wanted to say that you feel really bad about something, you would say, Kibuni Napoyo. Kibuni Napoyo. Kibuni Napoyo. And if you want to say that informally, you would just say, Kibuni Napo. Kibuni Napo. Voila, Korean word of the day for you all. Napuda. Napuda. It's like a poo. It's not a poo. It's a boo. Not buddha. Voila. All right, can I get that's all that I have for you today. If you enjoyed this video, please make sure to give it a big thumbs up and also make sure to hit the subscribe button down below. Also, if you want to see more from me, make sure to head over to thekpophero.com. Over there, I post lots of album unboxings as well as K-beauty reviews, so go on over there and check it out. Other than that, that's all that I have for you today, so sarang hamdada.